Yo, what's poppin people welcome to another video. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this one If you guys have not subscribed to the channel already people be sure to hit that subscribe button Hit the notification bell right next to it because we are the latest fishing channel on YouTube And that is a fact and we are about to do some fishing today boys and uh, if you guys don't know I'm actually outside of Let me get it. Let me get it. Let me get it dick sporting goods right here We're about to run in but let me let me give you a little bit background on this one So they don't like me filming in here. All right, but we, we might film a little bit, okay? We, we gotta go get some tackle. I feel like taking you guys along with me. We're just gonna keep it super low key and grab a few lures. And then we're gonna go take them to the old pond and go catch some bass. That's our plan, but we're gonna run in here. We're gonna grab a few baits and uh, yeah, and then we're gonna hop on the road. I think that's a sexy little popper right there. Look at that thing. Oh yeah, I think that's gonna do the job today. Actually, we wanna go bigger, go home. Let's get the Magnum popper, right? We're gonna be doing some top water fishing today. I'm going with this old Magnum popper. If you guys are wondering why I'm getting this little natural, just sexy shad color. So they got, you know, a chrome one and they got sexy shad. Well, today's a cloudy day and usually I prefer like a white um, on the bottom or like a chrome one. I am so close. But I, this is risky, but this is one we're getting. So this is the popper that we got. We are gonna be trying to catch some fish on this today. I have yet to try to do some topwater fishing here in Georgia, like straight up topwater fishing. So we're gonna give it a try today and hopefully we can catch some fish on this popper. But we're about to take this, throw it on that rod and then go hit the pond. All right, so we just made it out to the pond. We have our little popper, if I can get it off my thing. I'm excited about this. I'm hoping we can get some bites, guys. I don't know how this is gonna be. Like I said, this is the first time topwater fishing in Savannah. Yeah, I mean, I did I did some frog fishing, but I haven't, like, strictly just gone out here and tried to catch fish on top water yet. And the conditions today for this, it is so hot. I don't, I don't, I don't know what to really expect, honestly. But, oh my god, I did, did. That was first cast. Uh, That's first cast. Holy crap, guys. Did, that was literally first cast. And one creamed this thing. He just didn't get it. Well, that's a good sign. <laughs> oh my gosh. First cast, how one cream it. We're going to have to play around with the speed of this thing to see how they want it. I think it's going to be one of those long pause type of days. Long pause, pop. Long pause, pop, pop. Long pause, pop. That is insane. I cannot believe we got a bite first cast. <laughs> We would have caught one first cast. I don't know if that would have been good or bad. That should be game over. They're going to eat. Should be one in that corner that's going to smack this thing. Oh my god, I got him. Oh my god, I got him. <laughs> Guys. Oh my god. He choked it. He choked it. Oh my god. Good thing I brought my pliers today. Oh my god. And he is active too. He literally choked it. I mean, he literally. Oh, he's peeing. He literally choked that thing. Alright, good luck, Noah, trying to get this thing out. It is in the back of his throat. Literally, that last hook is in the back of his throat. Holy crap, guys. <laughs> Oh man, he's bleeding a little bit. We're gonna get him back in the water. That 
<laughs> we caught one right away. We had a bite on her first cast and then caught this little fatty. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be good. Thank God I remember to bring my pliers. I was literally thinking about it. I was like, I have to bring my pliers just in case. And that was like the furthest I've ever caught a fish on a popper. That was literally like the back hook where the hair is was in the back of his throat. Like, holy cow, that's a good sign. Let's get back out there. Next cast. Oh my God. This is unbelievable. This is unbelievable. That was next cast. <laughs> Guys, hit that like button, baby. Hit that like button. Unbelievable, next cast. Guys, it's gonna be insane. Listen, they're not much, they're not big, but guess what? If, if we're catching them like this, I don't care if they're big or not. That Just getting a top water bite right now feels amazing. Heck, only thing left to do is get back out there, right? Can we get three and three cast? I think there's another one on that bank. Oh my God, he just hit me. Holy cow, he just, he just like rolled under it. Is he gonna bite it? Can we get three and three cast? Come on now. I know we could do it. They're tearing this top water up. Guys, I think this bank right here has slight wind pushing up on it. I'm gonna go down this bank. This should be good. I mean, we had multiple bites on this bank already. I mean, it could probably only get better as we go down. Almost caught multiple. I mean, we've had multiple bites. And it is a steaming hot day today. That is just a good sign. It's been a while since I got to do something like this. Oh my gosh. That's why we're doing this video today, boys, because not only has it been a while since I've done something like this, I'm assuming it's been a while since you guys have done something like this, or maybe you haven't even done this before. Maybe you guys have I learned something today, but I mean, I don't know. It just blew my mind with how hot it is and that these fish are gonna bite. And this is like a really good palm, but like, I mean, heck, still kind of surprising. I don't know how they're gonna bite this in that wind. I guess we'll see. Oh my God, it's a good one. Oh my God, it's a good one. Oh my god. Yes! Holy crap, this is like a three pounder. Holy cow, he hammered it. Guys, look at that! On the freaking paw for me, it's called a three pounder. You might be bigger than that with that gut. Look at that. Oh my god. He destroyed that popper. Maybe this bank with the wind's gonna happen. We were just talking about it and we threw a cast in there and caught a solid freaking three pounder. Are you kidding me? I mean, look at this thing. Look how fat he is. Holy cow, thank you for biting, buddy. Oh man. Oh God, that was sweet. He was under this grass. This is like where they've been mowing, see? And he came out of nowhere and just crushed that top water. Holy cow, that's a solid three pounder. We just been, we just been out here for five minutes. I almost don't know what to say. I was about to reel it in. Freaking unbelievable, man. <laughs> we already caught four fish on the stopwater. Literally about to reel it in right there and he came out of nowhere and just hammered it. And they're hitting it aggressive too. It's not like they're just sucking it down. I mean, they're actually like hammering this thing out of the water. Like, <laughs> it's not just like an original just, okay, let me come suck this top water down bite. This is like, let me hammer the heck out of this thing. Oh man. All right. Heck man, this is insane. I'm not gonna lie, man. I, I was this, I was debate, I was like, you know what, should we go try to film a topwater video? I was like, it might happen. Like we might be able to catch like two or three fish. You know, we might be able to get a couple like just lucky bites and we make it happen today on a topwater. But no, we've already caught, holy crap. 
Holy crap. We've already caught four, about to get a five bass limit right now. I mean, what the heck? This is just insane. It, I, I did not expect it to be this good. We're working it pretty fast. I mean, I'm going pretty aggressive with this thing. It's not like I'm just basically popping this thing. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm working it pretty fast, not gonna lie. Not really giving them much time to look at it, making them just get aggressive with it and snap at it. I can tell you, I'm really curious to see what the water temp is in this pond. <laughs> I literally couldn't get a bite on anything else, yet we bring a topwater popper out here and just crushing them. Maybe it's about time. Oh, that's, oh my God, that is not good. Holy crap. Holy crap, I'm not laughing. This is not good. That, that would've, I would've been so mad if I had to run back to my truck and rig up another rod. Come on, fish. Oh! He drilled that thing. Oh man, that was the best bite yet. He drilled that thing. So crazy, man. I, I'm still speechless about this. I'm not really speechless because I'm talking right now. But... Oh man. <laughs> Hit that like button, man. That's all I got to say. See, we're throwing this along the bank. How about we try to throw it out here? I know there's a ton of trees and a ton of fish stacked on this tree, especially on a sunny day like today. I don't know if they're gonna come up. They definitely come up to eat this top water, how these ones are eating. Then again, these other ones have this bait pinned up on the bank. There's a ton of brush out here. Some little trees, little brush piles. It makes sense, especially with the slight ripple. To catch them on this top water over those piles, I just don't know how aggressive these fish are out here. So these ones on the bank can hit this a little bit easier. They can pin it up against the bank. Um, I, I just don't know. I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. Guess we'll see. What fish number is this, guys? Seven? Six? Put a count down in the comment section below. <laughs> this is so fun. This is so fun, guys. I hope you guys are having as much fun as I am watching this thing. Uh, <laughs> this is awesome, man. This is why we're the latest fishing channel on YouTube right now. Because we can go do some crazy stuff like this. Holy cow, man. I'm spe I'm not speechless, man. Why do I keep saying that? I'm freaking out. Tiny. <laughs> he just came up and swallowed it. He just kind of like sucked it down. I feel like he kind of swatted at it. He never hit it like with those other fish. So like I said, this little sexy shad popper right here. It's got white on the bottom. That's, that's mainly the biggest thing. It's got some yellow in the mouth of it. You know, the blue on the top and that whole deal doesn't matter as much, but it does have a little furry tail. Man, we are smoking them on this thing. It, when, I, when I went to Dick's, it was super cloudy outside. Now the sun's came out, we might just be hitting this at the right time. But usually when the sun's out, I throw more of a chrome, which is I, what I didn't buy. Um, and when it's cloudy, I usually throw some more with like a bone color or a white on the bottom when I'm topwater fishing. Um, that's just what's worked best for me in the past. And that's kind of what I roll with. And that's kind of the rules I go by. Man, they're just killing this one. I think we really picked the right color with that white on the bottom. When I throw this thing out there, I'm working it a little fast so they don't really get a good eye on it. You know, I'm, I'm popping it pretty quick. So if they're gonna eat it, they gotta eat it. You know, they're not really having a chance to sit there and look at it. They're having to make a commitment and that's why I feel like we're just whacking them right now. It's because we're making them, we're forcing them to eat it. We're not really sitting there doing it super slow. That first one I did super slow. As you can tell, that fish choked it. I believe we can catch them like that. This has a slight ripple on the water right here. And I believe this fast retrieve in the wind right here is what's making it happen. If I was doing a slow retrieve in this wind, I mean, I believe it could happen. But, you know, we're triggering these aggressive ones just to bite in it. I mean, as you guys can tell, it's working so far. Um, on these fish 
And there should be one right there in that corner, right there. We should get slammed. See back there in the calm water. Pop. Oh, we just hit it. He just nosed at it. He's behind it. Is he gonna hit it? Come on, baby. I am so surprised right here. If anywhere, if I'd expect one to bite, it would be in this corner because this wind is just chucking in here, pushing any bait fish along and any any bait that. There he is, finally. Yep, yes, sir. I'm about to say, man, there's not a fish back here that's wanting to eat. I'm gonna be very surprised. What is this, fish number 10, guys? I mean, heck, we only fished a little tiny bit of this pond. I didn't even, listen, I'll be honest with you, this isn't even the good part, like, that I wanted to hit. I think it's gonna get really crazy. This is, this is bizarre. Heck yeah. There's a fish moving around right here. Oh my God, oh my God. That was a big one. I don't know what that fish was doing. He's hiding under this grass. I honestly could catch one on a popping product today. It's nasty, and, and this stuff. This is just literally grass, like grass, grass. Like they just mowed the lawn grass. Look, they're all up in it. You just gotta work it fast, cause I get grass up on me. I should get slammed right here. <laughs> this is too much fun, man. He ain't big. He's just a little guy. He's just a little dude. Heck yeah, man. This is just too much fun. I gotta get the pliers for you, man. You cream that thing. 10 out of 10 on the blow up, man. 10 out of 10 on you, little buddy. Heck yeah, man. Let's see if there's another one out there, which I know there is, but will he bite? Oh, man. That was a baby, baby. I don't mind catching them. I want one. I want another one like that third fish, a dang three pounder, three and a half pounder. This cast is about to get slammed. Oh, whoa, I got him. What is that? Is that a bass? Oh my gosh. Oh my God. I would not expect you to be on that point. That is so small. You, you should be my pet bass. Comment below if you think I should get a pet bass because I've been debating so much and he would be the perfect one. Oh man, he would be the perfect pet bass, buddy. I'll come catch you another day. There's another one on that point. That wing coming around, you got a point, some grass on the tip of it. Perfect little ambush spot when that bait comes up around the corner, just like that. Another small one. Little baby. That is a huge bed. Yeah, it looks like there's some beds along this bank right here. I see another one. Oh yeah, we about to get slammed. You ready? Maybe I gotta slow down on this bank. I should get creamed right there. Oh my God, that's a good one. <gasps> there's a big one behind him. He's trying to get it out of his mouth. He's trying to get it out of his mouth. I'm gonna keep him down there. The big one's trying to get it out of his mouth. Oh my God, the big one's trying to, oh my God. Crap, he's right there. How you doing? I'm good, man. Doing good. I took the small one, there's a big one trying to get it out of his mouth. <laughs> I left him in there for a second. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was hoping. Really? I thought I had a monster, but I had probably two that were about three pounds. Really? Yeah. Wow. They're eating a the top water today, surprisingly. It's getting hot now. <laughs> getting good. There we go. We didn't get the big one, but we got this guy. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. It's been a minute since I've had a fish. They're just getting a little, I don't know. I didn't, this is my thing. When I was fishing on that other side where we started, they weren't on bed over there they were just roaming the bank or, or i was just catching the ones that were just kind of roaming around out there we had that wind pushing up on the bank and you know we were whacking them and now when i come down 
on this side of the bank all the beds are everywhere i see tons of fish on bed but they're just not wanting to eat this top water at all and i just spooked one right there but they're not even wanting to like give this thing time of day it slowed down a lot and i've noticed lots change and it makes sense i mean but heck i'm hoping we can get a few more on this That's what it took. And it feels like a good one. Holy cow. I was just about to explain what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. He's running at me. Ooh, he ain't a bad one. He ain't a bad one at all. Yes, sir. It's probably the second best one today. Look at him pee and look at that. Oh my God. He was over there on a bed or by a bed. A solid pound and a half. Look at his fat tummy. Look at his fat tummy. So I'll explain here in a second what I just did to catch this fish and how I'm gonna start catching them. So these fish out here on these beds are a lot more finicky, obviously. The ones that were just roaming on that bank. Well, this is what I'm doing now. And just what I did, I saw that shade over there. It looks to see that I saw a bed. I throw, threw up on that bank and I let it sit. I just gave it a pop, all right? Let it pause, pop, let it pause, pop let it pause and that slower presentation is what's going to get these bed fish but you the problem is you can't go walking up on them and do this like if they see you it's not going to work i mean if you had like a worm or something obviously you can catch them but on this top water and how i'm working this today this is all going to be a game with patience and throwing it near that fish and pissing them off enough so when i get on by that bed you know i'll pop it once i let it sit pop it a second time let it sit boom continuous like that boom boom every once in a while I'll switch it up with a little double pop so that's what's going to catch these beds that you know we just walked past and that's how these fish are going to bite you know it's going to be a lot slower which i knew from the start that's kind of how i started but then i realized that these fish are eating it aggressive but those that was when those fish were in those wind in that wind and they were just roaming and they weren't on bed like these bass these bass are going to be a little bit more finicky so it's going to be a slow pop pause All right, there should be a fish in this corner. Oh my God, game over. Game over. <laughs> there we go. Boom, just like what we were talking about. Nothing big, but he was right there in that corner in that shade. I slowed it down and he just cremated it. Didn't have a problem hitting it. You have to slow it down. That's the trick right here in this calm water, especially when they're on bed, and especially when you see some shade. That good slow pop is what's going to get it done. I want to throw in the same spot. <laughs> in the same spot, literally. That's slow moving. He's a little bigger. Oh, yeah. Heck yeah, barely had it, he swatted at it. Look at that one, that's not a bad fish at all. Boom, heck yeah, that's fat bass. Next cast, Let's see if we can get the third cast, man. That's the same spot of where that fish was at. Just slow moving that thing, just like what I was talking about. Heck yeah. There it goes, right back over there. Man, I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I had an absolute blast this day. If you guys are new to the channel and you guys have not subscribed already, be sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys have been enjoying the content recently and loving the videos, be sure to hit the like button as well. And also, if you could, there's a little post notification bell right next to the subscribe button. Be sure to press that because we upload three bangers every single week here on kicking the bass tv and uh yeah it's been fine with me guys it's been it's been a grind it's been tough i'm actually going off of zero hours of sleep right now i pulled an all-nighter last night and it's already one o'clock in the morning right now and i'm waking up at 4 30. really smart right but uh it's for the good content man we're going on spring break we're about to be filming a lot off the boat especially and we're gonna be having some killer videos but thank you guys so much for the support i love you guys so much and i'll catch you guys in the next Peace. Eat it up, eat it up, yeah, yeah. keep it up, keep it up. No, they gon' try you, they can't stop you. Eat it up, eat it up. Yeah.